New updates to Google Meet, this time with the host controls. So let's jump into it with another flipped classroom tutorial. Now the host controls in Google Meet are incredibly helpful whenever you're running Google Meet sessions. These could be online classes or meetings you're holding with colleagues. Now, a few weeks ago, Google announced that they were bringing new features to Google Meet host controls, and these have been fully rolled out now. So let's dive in and have a look at them. Here in my Google Meet, I've prepared a meeting and I'm meeting with a single student. Now, as we all know, that students can always unmute themselves whenever they want. I can remotely mute them, but they can still unmute themselves. Well, that's no longer the case. Google Meet has now added additional controls. So in the bottom right corner, you will see we have our host controls. And when we click on that, we have a new one. This here says, turn on their microphones. This means that we can turn this off and by toggling off this switch, now our students can no longer turn on their microphones. Here, for example, this is that student. And as you can see, this button is faded out because they don't have permission to unmute themselves. This is incredibly helpful when you're running webinar styled sessions or when you just have to demo something for say five or 10 minutes and you don't want to get interrupted. Another benefit of this is that you can use it with those younger students. This way you can toggle it off, read a part of a story and then only turn it on as soon as you want them to respond. Now, the great thing is, is that this can be toggled on and off multiple times during a single session. Now, another added control is the ability to share their video feed. So here, for example, you can turn this off. And when this is turned off, automatically that student will not be able to turn on their video feed. This again adds a lot of functionality. So to summarize a great addition to Google Meet and the way it interacts with everyone attending your sessions. You can disable them sharing their video feed or you can also stop them from unmuting themselves. Now at the moment, this is for everyone in the meeting. So you cannot disable the unmute for a single student or a single attendee. It's all or nothing. Now, another thing to note is that everybody needs to be on an updated operating system. If they have not updated to the latest Android or iOS version or updated their Chrome browser, they will be removed from that meeting as soon as you disable this functionality. However, if everyone is on an updated system, then this will work like a charm. Now I'll leave a link in the description below for some more information. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And if you wanna see the additional perks, we have that join button that you can click and then you will be invited to join our community. In addition to the perks mentioned there, you will also be invited to a private Discord group where we can discuss this video and talk a bit more about integrating educational technology into the classroom. In the meantime, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.